I'm an 18-year-old girl from China, and I'm six feet tall. I wasn't very tall when I was in elementary school, but when I started developing in seventh grade, I grew almost 15 centimeters at that year, and it changed everything. My fellow classmates, they were like 20 centimeters shorter than me, so they wouldn't let me fit in for all kinds of reasons. It is very hard for me to buy clothes. As a girl, I definitely want to look good. Get dressed in new trends of fashion, wear beautiful makeups, but things just don't work out for me. I can't find a single dress that fit me in the mall, so the only choice left is to buy clothes for men. Sometimes best friends teach each other how to look perfect, but I don't have any friends. I get used to it, and I'm pretty okay with that. Wearing an oversized black T-shirt with my favorite pattern on it every day, and not having to spend lots of time dressing up and putting makeup on. But you know, it just doesn't work for a girl. I'm even taller than most of the boys in my class. Actually, only five boys out of 27 are taller than me. As for girls in my class, I can't fit in because I'm so much taller than them, and it is somehow uncomfortable and weird to be with a person who is way taller than you. Sometimes I hate my body. I know that fashion models are tall, but they have perfect body shapes and they are good looking. But I haven't got neither a perfect body shape nor a good looking face. Classmates discuss about me behind my back, saying that I look like a fat tower or something. It gets really hard, especially when it comes to take pictures. Firstly, it is hard to put me into the right position, and secondly, it is hard to find the perfect angle. So most of the time, they just kick me out of the group and take photos without me. I get jealous of those popular girls who go out shopping in the mall and find perfect clothes in the trend and do makeups whenever they want. I have so many followers on social media. And get so many likes when they post selfies on the internet. I, on the other hand, have to accept the fact that I am tall and ugly. So that's why I decided to put my studies in my priorities because I have more time to become an academically intelligent person. When others are looking themselves in the mirror or trying to find the perfect angle to take selfies or shopping for new clothes, I am buried in my books, trying to become the best person I can be. So over the years, my grades are great. And I always get number one in my class. I'm going to college this fall to study economics. And here's a word for those who are not satisfied with your bodies: you can't change the way you look, but you can change your own image from the inside because who you are is who you choose to be. I am pretty satisfied with my body now, and I'm proud to be a tall girl. We totally jumped off the cliff and had to zoom all the way to shore because the dog chases us all the way to the end. Oh.